Many armies around the globe have been competing for the title of the strongest army in the world. With countries starting to cut back on troops and focus military spending on weapons, only the elite soldiers survive. Now we are left with strong armies that are comprised of the best soldiers. Don't forget to give this video a like. These are 10 of the most disciplined armies in the world. Chinese People's Liberation Army it is law in the Republic of China that everyone serves in the military. Luckily for many, this law isn't strongly enforced because China has so many volunteers. It makes up the largest military on the planet. The Chinese military, PLA, values discipline and loyalty and is starting to close the gap between itself and the USA as far as having quality educated and trained soldiers. The PLA soldiers only have two-year terms of service, which means they can cram the same information and training in two years that takes other militaries four years. This also helps the long-term military leaders have more knowledge and experience than their rival counterparts. Russian Army Militaries are known for their strict punishment on soldiers who act up, but Russia probably takes the cake. One of these punishments is called snow edging, which means having the punished soldiers edge out snow to make it perfectly square. Another unusual punishment is having soldiers who report with no weapon or lose their weapon replace them with large log-type bayonets. This must be working because Russia has the second most powerful military in the world. Indian Army you can imagine how disciplined an army must be if the commander is known to run six miles a day every day. Though it's the fourth most powerful military in the world, the Indian army has run into a little problem. It's known to be a very strict and uniform army, but now 10% of the personnel in the Indian army are considered overweight. To address this, the commander has started new rules that bar overweight personnel from career advancements and foreign postings. The commander won't even allow overweight senior officers officers to award medals during achievement ceremonies. North Korean Army North Korean citizens are held to very strict sets of rules and standards, so it's no wonder that their army makes this list. The conditions in North Korea are so poor that many of the soldiers are underfed. The soldiers live in constant fear of being punished or sent to labor camps, so they must always abide by the rules. There have even been stories of soldiers who got lost during their postings, and when they returned later than scheduled, their superiors lined them up and shot them execution style. The other soldiers couldn't even protest the unjustified killings in fear they would have the same fate. South Korea by law, South Korean men must serve in the South Korean military. This usually results in the soldiers being cut off from family and friends for 21 months. During the six-week boot camp training, soldiers aren't allowed to have music, phones, internet, or TV access, and they can only lie down when they are sleeping. In many instances, the soldiers in South Korea are taught to strive to be average. Doing something wrong means they will be punished, but then doing something extraordinarily above average means the rest of their peers will have to rise to that level as well, which is highly frowned upon. French Army the French army has been a force to be reckoned with since the 17th century. As far as professionalism and effectiveness, the French army is a serious world player. The French army has a strict set of rules when it comes to engaging in enemy fire. Even if they are under attack, they have to go through leaps and bounds just to get approved to fire back on the opposing attackers. USA when it comes down to experience and budget, no one beats the United States. But nothing prepares a soldier better than military discipline. Many times it's the mindset and discipline that separate a person from a soldier, and the U.S. Army puts a lot of focus on this during their training. Many times soldiers find themselves in less than desirable situations. Facing this, the average person would want to go home, but this is where the military discipline comes in. Having well-rounded and prepared soldiers keeps the U.S. military in control and at the top of the list of most powerful militaries in the world. Pakistan Army 
the Pakistan Army will allow 16-year-olds to volunteer for their service. Though they aren't allowed to step foot on the battlefield until they are 18, this makes them some of the youngest government-backed soldiers around. The Pakistan Army has always been compared to their number one rival, the Indian Army, and for good reason. The Indian Army outnumbers them two to one, and that is where their aggressive mentality comes in handy. The Pakistani Army is a very passionate military group. They believe in being aggressive attackers, offensive soldiers, and being highly self-disciplined. Japanese Self-Defense Force the Japanese Self-Defense Force has had some hits in its day, but is starting to make a comeback. The Japanese constitution actually doesn't allow the country to have a traditional standing army, and the Japanese people haven't been too fond of their military since the resounding loss of lives during the Cold War. Japanese culture puts a big emphasis on group cohesion and strategic planning, so this army has the attention for detail. The Japanese have a high-tech military and are constantly running drills that help them assess their their amazing planning skills to prepare their soldiers for any situation on the battlefield. Kenya Defense Force the Kenya Defense Force soldiers are known to be very disciplined and loyal to their superiors. This may come from their very strict punishments on errant soldiers. The KDF is known for its hard justice, where soldiers can be put in detention for long periods of time with no sort of trial in sight. Many of the punished soldiers are suffering from mental disorders such as PTSD that they acquired from serving in certain battles under the KDF. Sadly, the KDF doesn't recognize these mental disorders and many of these soldiers end up going through court-martial trials. We hope you enjoyed this video. Please take a second to give us a thumbs up and don't forget to check out other videos on our channel as well as subscribing so you don't miss out on any of our amazing content. Thanks for watching.